Hello guys, this is Kenani Weezy and today I'm going to be showing you how to create and install plugins on Ruby RS. Okay, first of all, create a new class in the main location SRC where we can develop the plugin. Call it main and extend it from plugin and then import that from org.ruby and add the constructor and the unimplemented methods alright set the priority of the plugin priority dot load this isn't that needed okay on server load this is the hook we want to use the other ones you can also use like if the player teleports that's the player who teleported and um, this is what the, what happens on attack request that's the player is attacking player is defending on bank the player who opened the bank whether or not the bank is open death walk log out login command all this different stuff that you can hook on to which I'll be always updating um, so on, on server load we want to perform whatever actions we want to perform so let's say like my other examples we want to print out donut to the command line five times actually three times because it gets annoying <laughs> it gets too like much so you can't even see anything else that's going on alright so say we want to print donut three times and we return true meaning this hook was successfully handled okay after that you just go ahead and copy that main class put it anywhere you want. I like to put it inside this um, environment folder that I have here. Here's the other ones I made before, sorry. Okay, now go back into your jar maker. Well, go into your jar maker. In jar maker. Uh, put the output directory to wherever you want to output the jar file. Alright, set so your input directory to that place where you copied the uh, main class into and go ahead and create the jar alright here's the plugin that you distribute to everybody and now this part in, um, incorporates installing the plugin and to install a plugin it's actually really really easy oh yeah and by the way from before we don't need this anymore okay to install a plugin all you have to do put it into the plugins folder and that's it now you have the plugin fully working you don't need to recompile you don't need to do anything just restart your server and um, it'll work fine alright so here's what our plugin did when the server starts which the hook is uh, right here the hook is right here after the server starts for every plugin in the uh, environment that's been loaded, if the plugin isn't null, then uh, execute the hook on server load. And we uh, filled in this on server load abstract method in our plugin to print donut to the command line three times. So thank you for watching um, this video. Um, I hope you guys could check out my site for Ruby RS www.rubyrs.org and the community is available, available at rubyrs.org slash forum okay thank you guys subscribe do whatever bye